Morning, folks. Happy Wednesday. Wet. When Wednesday. In Oregon. Snooze news. Southeast Portland bar fight ends in car crash and gunfire. Well, uh, we don't quite have the manners of Portlanders reformed like the city would like. Eventually, they would like to get that headline to read, Southeast Portland Brewery Brawl ends in bike crash and face slapping. That's what they would like to see. They don't like cars. They don't like guns. Bear at large near Tualatin Elementary School. Okay, well, the old duck and cover method uh, for the Cold War. They can start uh, teaching the kids to assume the fecal position. Fake bomb forces Astoria evacuations. <laughs> Well, obviously, uh, since it rains four and a half days out of five at Astoria, they had to stand in the rain. Take your umbrellas, people. Portland organization aimed at fighting homelessness is cracking down on bed bugs. Yeah. Bed bugs are up the crack in some of these homeless places, so they need to crack down on them. The Housing Authority of Portland says bed bug resistant beds will be placed in the Bud Clark Commons, a new facility in Old Town. Bud Clark Commons. Okay, well that's a bed bug magnet. Bud Clark, maybe it's Bed bug bed clerk comments. Beds are manufactured in Oregon, made from recycled steel, do not have a box spring, and there is no place for the bugs to nest. Oh, yes, there is. They'll bring them in, it's in their clothes and in the cracks. Bedbug Clark Commons will host a grand opening Thursday to show off one of the beds. Hey, Phil, go lay down on it. No, you. No, they said it's, it's bedbug resistant. Go ahead, lay down on it. No. No, uh, I'll, I'll take their word for it. The Commons is a men's transitional shelter whatever that means. What are they transitioning to? Women? <laughs>